everybody, Monty Reed here for Thrive Life, and today I just want to go over a couple of basic, basic things about the Thrive freeze-dried foods. So first of all, uh, most of you have already seen the video, Fresher Than Fresh, but if you haven't, one of the most important things with our produce is that it's picked when it's ripe, and it's the right color, it actually has flavor, it actually has nutrition, and if you talk to a, a botanist or someone, a farmer that knows they'll tell you that most of the nutrition, the nutrients, and the flavor goes into the plant those last couple of weeks right before it's harvested. And we pick it when it's ripe, and within a couple hours it's frozen, and it's flash frozen, and then we use a freeze dryer to vacuum out the moisture, and we seal it in the can, so there's no air, there's no water, and that gives it a long shelf life. Traditional produce is picked, it's the wrong color, it's green, it's rock hard, it hasn't had that last couple of weeks of nutrition and flavor added to it, so uh, they do that so that they can ship it long distances over several weeks and right before it gets to the grocery store they spray it with the gas that changes the color and actually speeds up the aging process and that's why when you get it home it goes, it goes bad pretty quickly. So what we're going to do for the rest of this video is just show you a couple of things. What do you do with the freeze dried corn? How do you use it in cooking? Sort of get you introduced to it. Okay. So you go over to the shelf and grab something. Uh, we'll just say we're going to grab some corn. And so how do you use the corn? You know, it's uh, got one ingredient, sweet corn. And you can just take it right out of the can and eat it. It's a great snack. You can also get a little bit of water boiling. And you just put some corn in there. It's that simple. And you literally can do the same thing with any of the freeze-dried foods. You just get the water going and you boil it for about two minutes and it's ready to eat. So after about two minutes the corn is ready. Strain it like that. And your corn is ready. Just takes about two minutes of boiling. Perfect every time. Now if you have a recipe that calls for corn, you just throw it in. You don't even have to hydrate it first. You just throw it in dry. It's Monty Reed for Thrive Life. That's the basics about the freeze-dried corn. Keep thriving, my friends.